Make some noise for Justin Kelly and Melinda Jagger! <laughs> First of all, how gorgeous does Melinda look right now? Thank you. Justin, you don't look so bad yourself, my friend, if I don't mind. How you guys doing? I'm good. good. I just chugged a Red Bull, so I'm even better. Just chugged a Red Bull. <laughs> yeah. She's got wings now. She's going to fly right yeah. on out of here. Man, this is exciting. Every time Degrassi comes here, the electricity is intense in this building. I love when you guys come by. You love coming here? Yeah, I mean, look at the crowd we got. I want this welcome every day. Can this we do that? Awesome. Every day. Every day. This is really good. Every day. Every day. It's mandatory. Yeah. It's got to happen. Yeah. Even absolutely. in my house? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Weird. <laughs> so I want to talk a little bit about last week's episode because I love last week's episode, especially with your character giving Eli, you know, maybe a creative boost with yeah. an illegal substance. First of all, yeah. How fun was it to record that uh, that set? That set. Oh, that was that was hilarious. We were at the table read, and we we first found out that what was for those of you who know uh, <laughs> what? what's going on. What's going on? What's really happening? <laughs> um, yeah, we we were so excited to shoot it, and uh, Monroe and I have been dying to do a comedic scene together for for the show. So it was, it was great. It was really fun. It was hilarious. I don't know what the better part was. Maybe you and the rollerblades, or you throwing <laughs> chips up to yourself. Tell me you're a better chip catcher in real life. Uh, Probably not. Um, no, uh, yeah, that was no, that was fun. The rollerblades, totally, just I loved that idea, and yeah. it was yeah, it was great. Well, um, you guys started out in a movie. The way Eli was describing it, it didn't sound like it was going in the right direction. I think we have a clip. Let's check out to see cool. what this movie turned out cool. to be. Okay. Love. Despair. Why? Why? Okay, I feel like I just watched the tape from the ring. Eli, Eli, what the hell was that? <laughs> that's, a that's a really good question. Um, that was a, a short film <laughs> made by Eli. No, that was, that was fun. That was real fun to shoot. Yeah. Yeah. Have you ever done something like that where you think it's so amazing the night before and then you wake up the next morning and be like, what, the, what was I thinking? This is horrible. <laughs> Melinda, you ever done anything like that? I mean, it's more so with outfit choices. I'm, I'm, I don't really make movies like that, but I think something's a good idea, and then I look at photos, like maybe like a couple months later, I'm like, like what was whoa. I thinking? That wasn't so cute. Well, you don't have to worry about that because your outfit choice is spectacular today. Thanks. That goes yeah. without saying. Girl. Now we haven't seen much of uh, Ali. Where is she? She's coming, and she's coming with a storm, and she is taking, you know, all the Degrassi boys one by one. It is a very we had her chance with this one. Yeah. She's um, right now currently with Dave, but they're rocky, and you know, there's she's just checking the boys off. So she off. is still currently with Dave. I, th I thought she was single and kind of spreading her wings. But you know, Ali, wings. she'll just go and toy with boys' hearts, and you know, I personally don't do that, so I can live through her. You know. Well, I'm staring in your eyes, and she's toying with my heart right now. True story, Melinda. Look at your little guard. <laughs> Put her on blast right there. All right, we got a brand new Calvin Harris video. It features Florence Walsh. I've been waiting a long time to get into this. Let's get into a brand new Calvin Harris here on NML. All right, with that said, NML, put it together for Jessica Tyler and Christine Pesberry. Have a seat. Man, the ladies look gorgeous. Am I right? Am I right or am I right? Absolutely. How are you guys doing? Great. How are you doing? Great, man. Every time, Fridays, other than the fact that we get to see a new Degrassi episode, uh -oh. when you guys come down here, it's it just goes ape blank. You know what I mean? It goes I, I crazy. We're really, really lucky to have these fans. So. Yeah, you guys. You guys are awesome. Yeah. <laughs>
Because we share the same fans. NMO fans, the Grassy fans are the best yes. in the world. Now, let's talk a little bit about the episode last week. I mean, your character has really been that shoulder for Becky, hasn't she? She certainly has. Yeah, it's nice for Jenna to help someone else with problems for once. It is, it is. Yeah. I mean, last week, <laughs> Becky's parents met Adam, but they don't know that he's transgender. Now... If this was your parents, your real life parents, how would you go about that? Would you go honesty right away or? It is, it's, a, it's tricky. It's it a is tricky really subject, tricky. right? But um, it's nice to see Degrassi dealing with something like that because it's very like new to this generation. And I don't know, with my parents, I feel like I would have to be honest. Me too. Yeah. I would have to be honest yeah. right away. And I think they would be accepting of it because if I like the person, then they must be a good person. Yeah, my parents don't really care. If I lie to them, I get a right off yeah, the crap right? in my head. All right. <laughs> True story. Yeah. Hi, Mom. Well, uh, Becky's about to tell her parents, and you guys thought that you might help her out. So let's yeah. take a look at the clip and see how it goes over. Mom, Dad, there's something I need to tell you. My boyfriend, Adam, is trans. Trans? Like, transient? <laughs> Sweetheart, are you saying Adam's homeless? Homeless? That was Becky's reaction when I told her. Homeless? Really, Becky? Guys, this is serious. Stay in character, please. Continue, Buttercup. Thank you, Dad. Adam is transgender. It means he was born a guy, but he got the wrong parts. Are you sure he's not just confused? God doesn't make mistakes. He made Adam exactly who he's meant to be. So, a girl? <sighs> I don't think I can do this. You're doing great. That is a tough... That is absolutely tough. You know, yeah. you gave her kind of the fifth degree, but I think Becky's parents might give her a little bit more of a hard time. You agree? Well, I mean, especially considering their religious background and everything, it might be harder for them to accept it, but I guess you guys will just have to wait and see. Yeah. Yeah. You were being a good friend, though, by helping her out. I was, yeah. yeah. <laughs> now, Christine, we haven't seen you at all this season. Where are you? Um, actually, I think I make an appearance tonight with Whisper Hug. But um, coming up, you'll see a lot of Imogen and stuff with Imogen's family again. Yeah, I thought Imogen might be a good person to talk to Becky about this. Maybe, you know, I was thinking... Totally, I, you, yeah, she because... Be a character to, yeah. Imogen's, like, really different, and I think she has good advice for different people. But, um, yeah, maybe Becky and Imogen should hang out and talk about they their differences. totally become friends. Yeah, totally. totally. I love Absol Sarah. Absolutely. So. BFFs forever, right? Yeah. Absolutely. Now, I like <laughs> Bianca and Drew's story as well because... The, I think there's a lot of high school kids that actually think that they're ready for marriage, uh, like a lot more than Crazy. people think. What, I was gonna ask, what's your opinion on high school marriage? Maybe take your time? Uh, yeah, take your time. Make sure that you know what you're getting yourself into. Mm -hmm. It's a big commitment, so. In high school, you can be so head over heels for someone and then be over it like next week, so. Yeah. Yeah. Or take she, your time. Or she can break <laughs> your heart. Do I sound bitter? I'm not <laughs> bitter. All right, well thank you ladies, we're gonna bring we're going to bring Justin and Melinda back. Don't go anywhere. We still have a premiere coming from The Wanted, and Austin Mahone is on the way. It's all here on NML. When Degrassi is in the building, it is crazy in here. Do not forget that I'm going to be talking to Austin Mahone very soon. Get that hashtag going, Canuck Mahomies, and we're going to see what he's all about in his new single. Uh, Justin, are we not the luckiest men in the world to be surrounded by these beautiful ladies? I know. Not just on the couch, Let's but everybody in the crowd. Are we not? Everyone in the crowd, very beautiful people. Man. All of you. This is the best job ever. Okay, now. Town hall debates seem to be kind of the thing that everybody's talking about recently, and we're not going to get into binders full of whatever, but we are going to put some top-notch Degrassi's. They're gonna let, we're going to let them ask you questions, okay? So they might want to know something that's coming up. They might want to know what's going on backstage. I'm nervous. Gonna, yeah, you nervous? Because we want honesty. Where's the Bible? Put, put Christine's hand on the Bible. Okay. Uh -oh. So we're going to start with the first girl. What's your name? My name's Marissa. Hi, Marissa. My question is, if you had the chance, which character would you switch roles with and why? Good question. Good question. Oh, I Very totally good question. know. I've yeah, already yours? thought about this. Yeah. Is this bad? <laughs> tell us. Tell us. Imogen. You I guys? love Imogen. I'm so flattered. No, but I love how outgoing and how, like, fun she is and... And I think she's really, like, she's got a strong personality. Yeah. And she really knows who she is. Yeah. And she also has a great fashion sense. She does. She absolutely <laughs> Love does. Love Imogen. She does. I think the people on the street want to be Imogen, too, banging <laughs> away out there. <laughs> I want to be Imogen! <laughs> what about you, Christine? Um, I would be Katie, because Katie is honestly all over the place, and she's so freaking cool. Uh, like, do you see that girl? She's, like, the coolest girl ever. And Justin, what about you? 
Eli. Was Eli? Like, yeah, yeah, because he's he's nuts, and I love it. Yeah. I was hoping yeah. you were gonna say Imogen too. Im well, that's that's my second. Yeah. <laughs> <That's, yeah. laughs> I think I'd want to be Tristan, yes, only for the hey. sake of he's so quirky and his fashion sense is always like he's wearing like ten rings and he has his own little like he doesn't care what anyone thinks. Like he's just Tristan and he plays. You know instruments, and he doesn't care what anyone does. Has. Everything. I have no musical talent He's whatsoever. So okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. I feel like I'm playing mod moderator here. All right, to the next question in the debate. <laughs> <laughs> Step on up. What's your name? Uh, my name's Sarah. Hi, Sarah. What's your question? Hi. Um. So I've been watching Degrassi for a really long time. I mean, I've been watching it since Drake was on, and I was just wondering, how do you guys feel about Drake finally graduating? Congratulations, Drake. <laughs> by the way, for finally graduating. Yeah. yeah. That's a big thing. Very cool. That's a big thing. That's super um, cool. Congrats. To Drake. Yeah, I mean, I think all of us have started acting when we were younger, and it's hard to keep up that and film like 13 hour days. So I think as much success as we have, I mean, school is really important, and that would be such a gratifying thing. And I saw his tweet, and his teacher that actually helped him graduate high school is one that. I had oh, in right. school, so I mean, it's nice that he's still connected to the roots and the people that he had when he was, you know, getting up there. So I think it's very humbling to hear that too. Like, oh, finally, yeah. grad that's awesome. Like, yeah, it's, it's a big accomplishment, yeah, it especially is. with everything that he's doing. So it is to take time out yeah, and make yeah. that happen. Okay, so everybody yeah, here has their high school degree. Put your put your hands up if you have a high school degree. High school. High school oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, totally. Yeah. <laughs> oh, crap. So I'm the only one here? I'm the only one. <laughs> still, that grade 11 calculus is still getting to me. All right, we're moving on to the debate, the, the town hall question. What's next? I'm Lauren, and I was hey, just wondering, we all know there's lots of drama on the show, so we were just wondering, is there any drama, like, off stage? Do you guys get along? Ooh, Are you friends? Good question. Yeah, we all on the stage. Each other in the eye. Eye. <laughs> like, we actually, just before we came out here, you know, it was really awkward. We can't be in the same room. No, <laughs> we're, we're acting actually, right now. We actually, yeah. Yeah, we actually love each other, and it's a yeah, big family. Big happy um, family. We have parties all the time. We're probably going to have a Halloween party, and, yeah, it's just a really big, happy family, which is great. Yeah, we're really fortunate, too, because there are so many cast members, and you would think, like, oh, there's got to be two or three. Like a real high school yeah. it could be right. catty yeah, but yeah. we got lucky we yeah. really did get lucky totally. it's the yeah. canadian Great. in all of us right isn't it okay so Very quickly humble. what what's your halloween costume start with you Christine. um i think we're being spice girls and i think i'm gonna be sporty sporty baby spice baby <laughs> oh ginger I, I even, okay um <laughs> I, he's gonna be scary Question. spice i'm gonna be scary spice yeah, yeah. um last year we we're all disney princesses i was, was princess jasmine one. you were pocahontas, pocahontas and Cinderella. Cinderella. i don't know what i'm doing this year but yeah I'll pick one yeah. of them. So nobody's gonna be Psy with me? Gangnam Style? We're not gonna oh. do that? Oh, that's a good one. Let's try that out. And hey, yeah. guess what? We have a brand new video from The Wanted. We're gonna get into that. Thank you, Degrassi, for stopping by. This is it. It's The Wanted. I found you here on Animal. <laughs>